And I know they're going to say I'm right wing for this, which is kind of hard to paint me as, but they might want to start rethinking some of these sanctuary laws that they have here in San Francisco because uh, you're allowing drug dealers to stay in the country that are undocumented. They're getting in trouble for selling drugs once, twice, three times. You know, I was locked up with a man from Honduras um, in 2019. He told me how he traveled here from Honduras and how he's out here selling drugs to the Americans. And, you know, uh, you know, and that's how he sends money back to Honduras. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, we, we, we sent, spent a brief time in the cell, not too long together uh, until I was transferred to federal custody. But, you know, three years down the road, I come I come walking down the street and he's out here still selling drugs, you know, and he re he recognized me. He was wearing a face mask. You know, they all a lot of the drug dealers out here, they wear face masks now, which is, I think, another uh, <laughs> another um, hurdle that the police are going to have to get over. Right. Because now they all wear masks. <laughs> you know, San Francisco, they encourage people to wear masks. And now all the drug dealers are wearing masks. You can't tell who is who. But, uh, you know, I wear a walk around maskless out here. So uh, he has spotted me. And sit, uh, like grabbed me and was like, hey, what's up, man? You know, and uh, I was like, man, you're still out here? It's, it's kind of crazy you're still out here and you just are not like, you know, <laughs> in prison or, or something. You know, I just don't understand it. <clears throat> it's it's pretty, pretty wild. That I was going to ask you about the impact of illegal immigration and the sanctuary cities, how, how Again, I don't know if I want you to, to speculate, but just how commonplace is it in San Francisco to see someone that's probably an illegal alien? How much control do illegal, illegal immigrants have over the drug trade in San Francisco, in your estimation? Oh, man. Uh, you know, I, I can't go around and say every one of them is undocumented, but I can say this is that um, a large swath of the drug dealers out here are <clears throat> from that uh, from that demographic. Uh, <clears throat> so I'd say probably maybe 80 percent. I would have to argue like 80 percent. I, I, you know, uh, it's kind of like the fentanyl franchise, as I call it. Uh, they kind of came in and kind of shut everything out. I don't even really know too many local drug dealers anymore, you know, as far as in, in that trade, the methamphetamine and uh, fentanyl trade. 